Ladies and gentlemen, the 14th edition of Fly vs Jerk is about to come to an end. Hi everyone watching this live at the Sport Fishing Fair in Stockholm and of course to all of you watching on YouTube. After three intense days of world class pike fishing, the teams now have six hours left until the final points will be given out. Right now we're having a tie between Leech Gator and Jigar.nu with two points each, but since Alex and Victor have a bigger pike in the total with an 11 kilo beauty from day 2, they would get the extra draw point and be the winners if it would end right now. However, with 6 hours left a lot can happen and we've seen last minute comebacks many times before. The teams don't know the results of the other teams, so whoever the winners are they have absolutely no idea. This has been the craziest season in the history of this format and several records have been destroyed, so winning this season will be more prestigious than ever before. Now let's cut the talk and enjoy the epic final of Fly vs Jerk 14. Fly vs Jerk 14 is brought to you by Watski, your online store for boating equipment in the Nordics. Buster Boats, iconic quality boats from Finland. One Boat Network, all together now. Westgear, your boat dealer in Sweden. And Big Pike Boats, premium boats for anglers. Welcome back to episode 6 guys. We are on the hunt. We're on the hunt. We're hunting the big fish. We have two, we need three more and preferably a really, really, really big one or really heavy one at least. Ah, that's what we're going for today. Uh, in order to win this, I think that's what we need to do. So uh, all in for top five and one huge yeah. monster. And all of you guys watching here at the Sport Fishing Fair, can we hear a cheer? Hello from Team Nace, Struft in the final episode of Fly vs Jerk. I think my feeling is we still have the chance to win. We, we just do. need one or two big fish. And that's possible. We're on the, the right water, we're on the big fish water. We're hoping, we're placing our bets on, uh, on the dinner bell after four o'clock. Yes. It's gonna be fighting, fighting all day for that one or two bites. It's gonna be difficult, but anything can happen here, anything. Let's go, my man. Okay. Hi, everybody at Sport Fishing Fair in Stockholm. We need to catch uh, three more fish. Yeah. And uh, it's gonna be a struggle. <laughs> but yeah, we're but gonna... Uh, I, I think we can manage. Yeah. We have uh, one fish every two hours now, so... Uh, yeah. I think we can fill the paper. And yeah. hopefully we can catch a really big one also. Yeah. But the wind is picking up. So it's... Uh, <laughs> maybe good. <laughs> maybe good, maybe bad. <laughs> we will see. Yeah. Follow us. Okay, so this is the final episode of Fly vs. Jigart 14. I'm Christian Keskitolo. And I'm Anders Kras. And we will try to catch a big fish. And that we go for now because we believe that will give one. The tactics is crystal clear. It's one big point. We're going for the big fish point. We do not know the result of the other teams, but it doesn't matter. We will go for the big fish. Yes! Go. Yes. Now it's the last part of the final day. And hello everyone at the Sport Fishing Fair watching. We finally have some good weather yeah. and now it's time for us to make it count. We have a decent uh, amount of fish. Uh, yeah, I mean, a decent uh, start. But a decent start, I mean uh, two meters fish. I but think, now yeah. we need some really big ones. Yeah. That's what we're here yeah. for. Yeah, yeah. We'll go. Let's go. Welcome back to episode six. Uh, you're watching it together with me, most likely at the sport fishing show. So I hope you're going to enjoy this. We changed location completely. We drove up to the river house, basically, where the power plant is pushing out the tailwater. Hopefully it's that big, big fish that's gonna beat Nay's fish standing in this hole. Most likely not, but... <laughs> <laughs> we have to live on the hope, man! <laughs> Alright, uh, Team Powerboat Mercury here. Me and Pasi decided to stop fishing at 70 fish. As Pasi said, that uh, pretty much for sure we have the number point, so... Yeah. If we gotta have one chance to win, we need to have one real big one or five long ones. So we quit fishing now and take up the boat and go as fast as we can to a new lake and yeah. uh, get those big ones. All right, let's do it. Come on. Yeah. Hey. 
Nej, jag tappade veven. Vilket jävla hugg. Oh, what a strike. I even lost. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, that was so hard. Then I lost it, you know, and I got slacklined and oh, Come on. Just hammered it. God damn it. Come on, man. You know that that strike, you know, that was, you know, that was not like a normal, you know, the, it just boom. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Exactly on the same spot as the 114. Exactly on the same spot. You cannot be losing this. You know. Damn. Yeah. This feels good, Bjorn. Good shakes. Anchor or no? No, 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 no. Okay. Oh, this one is heavy. Try to help. Okay, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Leave the freaking engine. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yes! Yes! Number Come on! Boom! <laughs> Number three! <laughs> Yes! Oh, I was so nervous. I was so nervous. Number three. Good, Jacob. Freaking hand to time. Oof. You know when you feel straight away that yeah, this is a good one. You know the feeling. <laughs> yeah, I know the feeling, but still, you know, you never know until it's you know there. But I, this one I knew. Okay, okay. That's over a meter, so. Uh, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's for sure. The conditions right now is is. Uh, awesome for pike fishing you know you got the wind cloudy sun is coming down from time to time you know it's it's the best condition you can hope for when you don't want to be outside this is when you want to go pike fishing that's for sure all right guys there we go ah beautiful lady <laughs> yeah she's a beauty she's a beauty she's heavy man look at those colors really yeah. heavy Look at those colors. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Put her on the measure. Can you take the, the tape? Yeah. Let's see here. I'm here. 106? Yeah. One, uh, one six. <sighs> Give it up for Jacob and Björn for catching the first pike of the episode. And what an absolute beauty then. Last year's winners are in the zone and as always they deliver when it's needed the most. With 4 fish on the board they now have a top 5 of 408 cm and I'm getting flashbacks to the previous season when they had a fantastic final day with 6 pike over 1 meter which earned them the trophy. As you know Jacob and Björn qualified their way into Fly vs Jerk by winning Sportfish Masters back in 2017 and if you want to do the same make sure to register your team for the Fly vs Jerk Open qualification in June. More information at tournaments.canalgratis.se After lunch report I will start up with this bait the lazy distance with the paddle tail that worked so brilliantly yesterday all the four strikes from big fish was on this bait so I will go for this today that will be my go-to bait today for the big one you'll see can it just boom too fast one. I, I, I like to struggle for the last one. <laughs> you don't think we have done that enough? <laughs> yeah, but that's uh, our game. We have to struggle to yeah. succeed. One fish, Daniel. One fish could be enough. I'm not happy that the sun has changed to be so sunny today. Oh. I'm happy my arm didn't fall off yet. Huh. Sometimes people ask me, hey, do you go to the gym? Then I say, no, I fish. I go pike fishing. Yes. All right, let's change spots. Yeah, let's go. Let's go to the wind side. To the windy side. Mm. You decide. You decide, I go to the windy side. Team Neistroft is by far the team who has covered the most distance throughout the tournament and has already driven more than 30 kilometers today. Sometimes it makes sense to spend a lot of time in one or a few areas where you know there are big fish, like Team Leech Gator for example. But sometimes it pays off to run and gun and chase down the hunting ladies. I would say we do it like this, anchor, two cast, yeah. let go, anchor, two cast, okay? That's a great idea my friend. Ah, 
let's uh, make something out of this tough day. Some of you guys maybe watched Birch Pro. Unfortunately, Toby and I had great bike fishing and exactly at this spot. We caught a 50 perch here, but we also caught several meter pikes. I think till 114. That would be a fish we really need right now. So that's why we also came here. Daniel? Yeah. Be ready. I'm ready. Yeah. Give me that leader touch so I have a I have a fish in this episode. <laughs> yes, there you go. <laughs> yes, a fish in the episode. <laughs> we have to be happy for small things at the moment. Monster. Hope you guys in Holland see this. This is how a Swedish monster looks like. Should we go for numbers today, Marcus? Maybe we should. We got seven. <laughs> That's embarrassing. There were two fish here. That looks better. Ah, uh, not really. Let's see. Well, there's some fish in this hole. Yeah. I'll unhook it for you, sir. Ah. <laughs> well, this one was actually fat too, so. Look how beautiful they are. Okay, so it's now one o'clock. We have um, put the down, boat down in our, uh, our new area we're gonna fish. And this is the first spot. We have some logs on the bottom, obviously. And we also have a good amount of bait fish and uh, eight meters of depth. So hopefully we'll we'll find them here. But follow us. One o'clock. We we need two up. two more. We need we need one more of a meter. Then we need that monster pike. We're just gonna reposition around uh, the reef and uh, go for it again. Yeah, we'll. But we'll we will do our, our best. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Always. Come on. So nice, Pass is making food. I'm filling the car. We're gonna drive like maniacs to this uh, lake and get that big one. You want the kebab or chili? Chili. Rock and roll! With the number point more or less secured, Lasse and Passi are now sacrificing valuable fishing time to have a chance at stealing the big fish point. Up north, Team Headbanger are also targeting the big ladies and know that any strike could be a really big fish. Fish! Nice. Good one? Yeah. That's uh, decent. Yeah, it's a decent one. Maybe. Ooh. Some weight to it. Here it comes. Yes! Damn, that bite. That's Just a 10 to... kilo bite, man. Yeah, it is. Ha <laughs> 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 Woo! Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, what a bite. It just... Yeah, oh. I don't know how to say it. It felt like just wheeling into a big rock. Team Headbanger does it again. The current top fish is 9.8 kilos and Marcus and Manuel guesstimated this one to be around 10 kilos. Let's have a look. Oh, nice fish. Yeah. Take the back. 115. Yes. 115. Nice. It's a nice fish, man. Nice. Really happy with that. <laughs> awesome. That's good. Great fish for the top five, but more importantly, it could beat the 9.8 kilo top fish by Leech Gator. And if it does, Marcus and Manuel will steal the big fish point and the lead of Fly vs. Yerk 14. So it's zero. Okay, it's not 10 kilo. No. Uh, 9.63. Yeah. 963. I really thought <laughs> that that fish would be over, but yeah, it's a bit skinny. 963. Well, well, well. At 9.63 kilos, it's just 170 grams from taking the lead of the whole tournament. Close, but no cigar. See, you guys, it's a burbot tail in the in the mouth of the fish. <laughs> now we're going to release this one. I just caught a. 150 centimeter pike as you could see it was uh, blind on the one of the eyes and maybe just maybe this did a trick because the rocker head dive is pushing a lot of water so even if the blind pike didn't see it he for sure felt it it's making a lot of pressure in the water it didn't earn them any points but give it up for marcus and manuel for yet another fantastic fish further south Team Diva are still chasing their first approved pike of the day. Now it's time to shine, Christian. 
Yeah. We don't want to be at the sport fish fair with no fish in the final episode. <laughs> no, that's for sure. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the excitement is high now. Vi är fiskare, vi ger aldrig. What do you say? Now I'm just quoting people randomly. Pepping myself with some random quotes from random people. But this, the curly, the laser distance with the curly, it looks really nice. I'm confident that if I just get close enough to the right pike, then that pike will strike. When going for the big ones, a little motivational speech often helps to keep the spirit up while waiting for the strike. Oh, it's a big one! Oh, it's, a, it's a nice one. Is it a nice one? It's a nice one. It's a net, it's a, it's a net fish. Oh, it's a good fish. Oh, freaking hell, Christian. Are you ready, Mr. Cross? I'm ready. <laughs> what a strike! <laughs> oh my god, what a strike! You Don't really... lose it now, Christian. It's looking good. So it's, it's, nice, it's a nice pipe. Is, is it a big one? Yeah, it is a big one. Alrighty then. <laughs> look, 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 look. It's a fair one. Is it still far away? Alright. It's a fair one, yes. Are you it's, ready? It's a fair one. Where do you want me? Here. Here. Oh, ooh, 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 don't lose that one. Lift, lift it, lift. Oh. It could be a 10 kilo fish. It might be the one we want to have. Oh, look at that fish. It's a, it's a long fish. Comes here. Oh! Yeah! Yeah! What have I done that thing? What have I done that thing? That was a super freaking hell! Freaking hell! Sometimes you should be lucky. That's my birthday. <laughs> that was a birthday present. Thank you, Anders. You're the man. <laughs> <laughs> You're a saver. Not I freaking took. <laughs> not only making a cake. And give me a present. Also gives oh, me a present with the net thing. Oh, super nice. Who heard a strong fish? This oh. is a nice one. That's a nice one. Yeah, it's a nice one. Good. We'll see. We'll see. I doubt it's a 10 kilo, but hey, uh, okay, have, hey, a look, hey, have a look. Have a look. Have a look. Let's have a look. I'm, I must say, Christian, no one can take away that you are a big pipe master. <laughs> the big pipe mastery. <laughs> mastery. Mastery. <laughs> How sometimes key, we get key. lucky, sometimes we get lucky. Yeah. But at, at some point in time, it stops to be luck, right? <laughs> got loose in the same moment you put down your net. <laughs> and we got it. Sometimes Basically, you pulled it and it had a little, bit of, it had a little it. bit of speed. I already pulled it the and net. in the pull, it continued into the net. I was, that ooh. was the luck we needed. <laughs> that was, that was that, my birthday luck. It's a fat one. It's a fat one, but it's not, I don't think it's long enough. So we'll see. Let's see. Doesn't matter. It's no. a really nice pike. I will be happy for every pike in that size. All right, there we go. Oh, that's a nice fish. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. It's a nice fish. A oh, really healthy one. Uh, yeah. Oh, a really it. healthy one. Right, okay. Careful with your fingers. Hang on. Yep. <laughs> okay. 108. 108. Yeah. All right. Okay. Back in the net. Yep. 108. Then it shouldn't be 10. It, but it can I be 9. Plus. I doubt it. I it doubt can it. be 9 plus. But anyhow, there could be another one, bigger one, on that spot. Yeah, it's a spot. Because we it's a just spot. arrived to that spot, try to find one sheltered spot because it's, it's windy like 25 meters per second. Once again, if it's heavier than 9.8 kilos, Team Diva will snatch the big fish point and the lead of Fly vs. Right. Yerk 14. Let's find out. Yeah, it's 10.20. Uh, yeah, and, and we have to remove the weight of the sling, so, yeah, which, is, which means that will be a, a, approximately right on a high eight, kilo. right? Eight point something, eight point eight or something. With the weight sling removed, the pike officially weighs in at eight point fifty two kilos. A very nice fish, but not enough to threaten Team Leech Gator. At least it's a great fish for the top five, and it proves their tactic to target sheltered areas to be working. Okay, then that's a start. Eight point fifty two. Was it though? So. 0.52, yeah. I doubt it will be enough, but it's a nice pike. Good. Good. That was good. 
from nothing. From out of nothing. Doom! <laughs> but we have, been, we have been saying that to each other. Oh, Just have... like that, from out of nothing, <sighs> suddenly the confidence is back. Suddenly the confidence is back. Uh, it's kind of slow fishing now. It's four hours left and uh, we don't manage to get those strikes at the moment. So uh, the last two hours we didn't have any strikes. So we have to get two strikes in two hours now. So we have uh, two hours left to get the, that final strike. But it's, uh, it's really hard. Yeah. Small. Yeah. Yeah, but it's a fish. Yeah. It's a really small one. But it's a fish. Finally a bite, but not a big one. Small one. Let's see. How much? Uh, 70. What? 77. Okay, bye bye then. Back you go and grow. Three fish now. On the natural perch, 35 centimeter. We're fishing like a shallow plateau with grass and a deep edge just to see if we could find some active fish in the weeds. At least we found one. Oh, missed one. Uh, maybe bream. Okay. I don't know, it felt like uh, some nibble. <sighs> Hello, strike. Yeah? Yeah. Ah. Ah, why? It's getting closer to the dinner bell, I have to say. Yes. It can only get better from here, man. Actually, what we are doing now, we are quite deep. We are over 12 to 15 meter, but we are not fishing on the, on, the, uh, on the ground. As you see, the bait fish is chilling at six meter. And that's where we want to present our Lewis as well. Strike this one. Yes. Crazy. Nice. I think man. It's a small fish. Doesn't matter. Nice, dude. It's a. It's a ninety. What? Thanks, mate. Oh. My net was a bit tangled, that's stupid. I wet the measure board real quick, it's 90, it's not a big one, but yeah. at least a fish. It's, it's a, it's a... Um, it's a start. Yeah. Not even 90, right? Uh, 89. 89. Yes. Nice, nice healthy fish. It. She's fat, man. Look at, the, if this fish would have been 120. Boom, boom. <laughs> First fish. Dude, we're on the money. But have you seen it? You saw, it. did you see the strike, the first one? Boom. Yeah, it was the like, oh, and then he went a bit further, boom. <laughs> <laughs> there must have been a hard strike. The yeah, it one. was a really hard strike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this get me, it gets me so hyped. I'm, I'm happy. I'm full of confidence now. I'm actually, I'm using the eel. You're using the pedal tail. Oh, <laughs> oh. All right, and next time I'll, uh, Make sure the net is all right. This was weird. Ah, no problem. I mean, would have been uh, that been uh, 120. I would be a bit more like, oh, Daniel, please. Yeah. But I'm happy. I'm very happy. Me too. Yeah. Long front. And no, 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 no! Damn it! We have lost so many today. This is this is insane. That was, insane. That was a good fish, Pia. What? That was a good fish. Yeah. Come on, man. Can believe it, man. You know the two two first head shakes. Boom. Boom. Yeah. What can you do? What can you do? Now how about hook it and net it and measure it and release it? How about that? Oh, 
Come on! Jacob and Björn need one more pipe for their top 5 and have missed several good bites. Time is slowly running out and they just can't afford to lose those chances. Yeah. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. I'm there. Woo! It's a decent fish, yeah. It's a decent one. I was scared there, man. I was like, ooh, don't, 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 don't. Oof. Well done, man. It's number five. Beautiful, healthy pike. <sighs> Beautiful. Beautiful fish. Yeah. 94. 94, that gives us... I think that's 502. 502, yeah. yeah. Well, it's a start. We only need that big one now. Kick off that 80 fish with a giant. Yeah, we need that giant now. Yeah. This is what we need. Well done. Then may, maybe, maybe, maybe we have a chance, maybe. maybe. Well, let's let her go. What a beauty. First team to secure a full paper and now they can start upgrading. 502 centimeters is a solid score, but there are seven other teams doing everything in their power to destroy them. Oh, yep. oh that's a nice one! Oh, well done, Anders! Yeah, man! Yeah, man! Yeah, man! Bring him on! Bring him on, man! That was a good take. Good. We like good takes. Oh, my turn to net. I'm nervous of your netting. Actually a big pike. It's a good one. Actually a nice one. Okay, let, let him go. Switch the side. Okay, there we go. Oh! All right. Here it is. Okay. Here it is. I'll take this one. We don't need to weigh it. Now we are on something. Now we are on something. We have searched and searched and searched. And now, finally, we find a spot and tuk, tuk, two big ones directly. All right. It took this baby, this good old baby. My favorite, the flash parrot. All right. Let's have a measure. Yep. Let's have a length. This is an old, old warrior. Yeah. It's been hooked before. Somebody had damaged the... Yep. My mouth. Thank you for that. The slapping pike. All right. Okay, it's uh, not 105, it's actually 103. 103? 103. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Let her go, let her go. We have a uh, two and a half hours left, a little bit more. Now it's two. a fight against the time. Two hours, 45 minutes, and we just need three big pike. Or one huge one. <laughs> or 45 ones. <laughs> yeah. Now that was that was that tiny little spark that we needed. Yeah. Now we have Come a spot on. and we know that if two pikes like that are in this area, there will be more. Absolutely. For sure, for sure. So two we'll, pikes have approved, then for sure there's more. We will spend the rest of the competition here. Now it's a race against the time. Yeah. Uh, we changed the area. Finally we got here from three hours crazy driving and uh, we're gonna launch the boat real quick. We got some hours to get some really big ones. Let's catch them. We yeah. in a hurry. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Ah. Let's do it, Pussy. Yeah. We're gonna stay here at the same place with the deep hole in this lake and uh, yeah, we had some really big followers yesterday, but it was so windy and so cold and rainy so they didn't bite. So we hope they're doing it now. Okay. Yeah, something. Yeah, they are here. Okay, so we're fishing this really big backwater at the moment with kind of hard streaming. This one was just standing with a side of the stream. Beautiful one, really wide back though. Okay, good job. Up north, Team Vision have had three incredibly tough days despite the very good pre-fishing, but there's still time for the big ones to wake up. Oh, oh big one! Maybe not. Or maybe, I don't know. Oh. Oh, it's a fish at least. Yes. Next. Ah, f*** yes. 
Even if it's 80 centimeter, we need to net it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's a little bit bigger than 80 centimeter. Uh, yeah, it's close to a meter fish at least. Nice. Yeah. Ah, it's not that big. At least it's a decent fish. Yes. <laughs> hey, good job. <laughs> oh, finally. <laughs> okay, I know where we're staying. We're in the hole. Yeah, it's a nice fish. Hey, you know, you had this fish already. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's the same fish. It's the same fish you caught here the so first we'll day. we'll be basically now gonna be 87. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If, if I remember correct. We can recognize it because it, did, it only had one of those fins there. This guy wants to go, really? Again, today again? <laughs> <laughs> but we're fishing this deep hole here. It's uh, 8 meters, so I'm fishing a sink 7. And then actually an unweighted fly, but this is one of these big articulated with saddle tails. This is a quite bright color, but it goes really side to side. So you can fish it really slow. But it's cool that it was the same fish that Marcus caught two days ago. But it's sad because then we know that there's not that many fish in these holes here, so... But uh, it is what it is. Just have to continue fighting here, see what happens. Oh, Daniel, the bream. What? Look here. Come, 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 come. The breams are here. The bream is here, you see it? Was you have a bream? You see it, right? Yeah. They are at home. That's good. I mean, after the day we had yesterday, I thought it might be more active, but I know days like these on this water, so nothing to worry about. It's just important that we catch this one fish. But of course, it's, it's not easy to keep the concentration up all the time without any action, without any bite. That's the hard thing about this water and I think that's also why many people struggle here. We'll see what happens. I'm still confident that we catch one big fish that we need. I'm really curious how the other people catch. Of course, all the participants choose a water today which they have best fishing. So I think Headbanger We'll definitely go to the same water. But also diver and leech are always good to get you really big fish. Yeah, we are here poor fisken, but... What the fuck, alltså. 200 E45 man som kommer ge oss de fiskarna vi vill ha här. De här, det här sticker liksom inte ut bland alla braxar. Nej. Men det verkar som att pajken är inte i braxarna. Nej. Och de är typ så här utanför braxarna och... Du vet, blir det jag här? Ja. Då blir det galet. Ah oh shit, handleden håller på att ge sig alltså. Tre jävla timmar kvar. Är det det? Ja. Fan, vi behöver den. Fan, kan vi inte bara smälla till med en 119 och en 120 eller något? Där står jag. Tror jag. Den där är Bronto kan jag säga. Den där är Bronto. Ja. Ja, du kommer perfekt. Den här är bra. Yes! 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 Oh. Den här är Bronto! That's a nice fish! Oh shit! Oh shit, 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 shit! Nej, uh, wait, oh. I think the cutter. Oh shit, 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 shit! Oh shit, 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 shit! We need to take her in, into the boat. She's gonna jump out it. <laughs> this is a 120. Yeah, yeah. 
and I'm fat. Yes. Oh shit, that take. You saw the take? Yeah, on the. I was so ready, I put my rod down. <laughs> Just if she's gonna. Yeah. Ooh. I said that's a bronto. Yeah. We're uh. fishing on the fish all the time. Yeah. It's. Ooh. Uh... Oh shit, we need to take her in. Okay. You mean this is a like heavy fish? Take her in. Okay. This is a big one. This is a really big one. This is like 13 kilos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Whistling. Now it's set. Just wow, that's a beast of a pike. They already hold the big fish point at 9.8 kilos, but this looks like a significant upgrade. Keep my arms up. I can give you 12.6. Yeah. 12.6, okay. That's perfect. Give it up for the fifth biggest pike in Fly vs. Jörg history. A 12.6 kilo tank caught by Team Leech Gator. So nice, so nice. Great fish, We have Alex. been yeah. like one night in. Yeah. Casting the 45 centimeter and 330 gram catfish for three days straight sure takes its angler, but if you put in the reps, you may be greatly rewarded. We run the town, run the street, them too. Let's look if we come through. All of the man, they're ready for war. You can never test my crew. From, from nothing. We are standing and casting and casting, and then I just look uh, around if we have caught uh, like a follower or something, and then she was standing. Oh, what a fish! Yeah. So nice. Oh, what a fish! <laughs> okay. Uh, it's crazy. We've been seeing so many fish and they they do not take they just follow to the boat uh, yeah. when we have cast we have two three pikes every time on on uh, some spots and then now i just like i do it sometimes i go back and turn if we have some pike around and then i saw her and yeah. i said to victor like <laughs> that's a bronto yeah. so i cast it out and then she took yeah she like followed to the boat and, yeah. and not taken like they are so picky yeah but once again, the monster cat, 45. Yeah. Now I'm gonna change the color. <laughs> <laughs> now we have four fish, but three good fish. So hopefully we can manage to catch two more. That would be like an insane achievement when it's been like we have been casting now for 26 hours, 27 <laughs> hours straight, like with 330 gram lures. It's starting, and also for for, for the pre-fishing. This I'm, is the. Day. I'm retired when I when I come home. Like I'm <laughs> going to <laughs> go to bed for one week. Okay, nice, Alex. That's crazy. Oh, and just cast without the weight on like everything from like three four meters up to ten and just retrieve it slow and the bait will do the rest. I promise you, they will catch big fish for you. Alex and Victor just made it a little more challenging for the other teams to overtake the throne, but this is fishing and crazy things can happen at any moment. Oh, there, look, 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 that's a big fish. I saw it, that was a big fish. It's a big fish hunting in the surface. Now we really have to try to catch it. Oh look, look, that's a huge pike, Marcus. Look, 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 it's so big. Yeah, he ate something and it's, no. Yeah, he has it in the mouth. He has it like a 17 yeah. mouth. That's so cool, the experiences you get <laughs> when you're out fishing. Like it's a big pike with a small pike in its mouth. That's like a, look, look at that. Wow, wow. <laughs> that's so cool. Look at that. <laughs> that's pretty cool, actually. <laughs> that would be good if we could catch that fish.
If you ever thought your lure was too big, well think twice. The small one is around 70 centimeters and God knows how big the other one is. The only thing we know is that Team Headbanger really needs it, but she already has a mouthful. Oh, he got, he got rid of it. I have it perfectly on the drone. Boom! <laughs> Marcus and Emanuel know now for sure that there's a very big hungry pike just a short cast away. She lost her afternoon snack and she's not happy about it. The dinner bell is ringing. Come on, how freaking crazy was that? This is the kind of stuff you wouldn't believe if the cameras weren't rolling, but luckily they were. Get her into the net now, guys. Okay, coming, coming. Yes. <laughs> <Whoa! laughs> What's happening? That was so cool. And it's the same bike. It's the <laughs> same bike. <laughs> oh, we live in a crazy yeah. world, man. And it's, oh. it's totally inhaled the banger shad. You See? never <laughs> stop getting surprised when you go fishing. <laughs> Have a look at that. <laughs> oh, Way to go, so man! Cool. That's just so freaking cool. Oh, I can't find any words for this. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh, the the wind is changing in our favor, my friend. Yeah. Home. I mean, I've been experiencing some crazy stuff on pike fishing but this is high up on the list yeah 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 for sure yeah, i mean we saw when the pike took the smaller pike up in the surface <laughs> it just has splashed and then we tried to throw there because we thought it was just a pike hunting and then we saw the pike just holding the smaller pike yeah. and then when we saw it when it dropped it I you made it there, yeah, yeah. And, and boom! I was like, I d it didn't take it straight away. I was just holding the bait there in that area, like twitching it. And that was a really good bite. <laughs> Let's have a look. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> look at that. Oh, completely inhaled. It's long. Yeah, it's very long. Actually. Yeah, it's very f***ing long. 113? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's the craziest 1 meter 13 pike I have ever caught. <laughs> Jesus. Ah, so cool. What a lovely fish. Some fish are more memorable than others, and I'm pretty sure that girl will stay in a mono's smile until he takes his very last breath. She also made Team Headbanger steal the top 5 point from Giga.new and now we're having a tie between Leech, Gator and Headbanger with 2 hours left to fish. This is not over yet. Okay, Christian, uh, let me guess. I think uh, Stroft has a big one. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. think uh, Vision has the number point. Yes. And I believe uh, Headbanger has the top 5. Yeah. Yes. Right now we have no top fish really. No. And we have no top five result yet. No, no. And, and really that, no numbers either. So I, what's your guess? Ah, well, I, I think you are correct on that. Uh, that's, a, that's a good guess. But we know there are 120, 130 fish swimming around yeah, in this yeah, area. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So but right now we don't have any result. So. Right now we don't have any result. We no are way. on our way. So let's cast. Jigar could have the number point as well. Could be, could, could be. be yeah. yeah, this is this is not a small one. I didn't see how big it was, but it was. It's not a small one. It's not a small one. Please be the one. I, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. No, 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 no. Oh. Good one, man. It's not the one. It's not the it's one. A small upgrade. I think. It's not the one, but it's still an upgrade. It's still a beautiful pike, but it's not the one. Small upgrade for Jacob and Bjorn. At 92 centimeters, it takes them to a highly respectable 511 centimeters, but they're still 7 centimeters behind Headbanger. Time is quickly running out, but every angler knows that it only takes one cast to catch a monster. The tricky part is to know which of the thousands of casts it's gonna be. 
Over in Finland, Team Powerboat Mercury are betting on one last minute beast to put themselves on top of the scoreboard, but the pike are not cooperating. Pick it up. The one in the front is probably a... Ah, oh, I missed it. F***. Yeah, there's one pike coming up. Reel it in. Yeah. Got... No! Oh! What happened? Ah! That was a big fish. I didn't feel it. They didn't yeah. strike. Oh, yeah. That's a big fish. Not a 10 plus, but a really That's nice fish. 10 maybe. Yeah. Good DJing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is the fish that Lasse caught. Healthy looking bike. It's 103. Okay, this is what we came for. Yeah, like, nah, not this one, the bigger no, one. No, the bigger <laughs> one. Okay, but we really, this 103, keep on casting. So that's a good start, 103 centimeters. Really healthy looking bike. Okay, good one, Pasi. Yeah, good start. We we'll take more. Yeah. Sometimes you have to take a minute to relax, but never without fishing. Relax, but still fish. Relax! Fish! Oh! Fuck! Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> no! Oh! Hard strike? No, slow strike, but it was f***ing heavy. Oh my god. No. No. F***. Ah. And it's dinner bell time, right? It's four. Yeah. We need that fish, my friend. <coughs> but hey, there's a chance to get them. This is the spot, I tell you. That was a f***ing big fish, man. I didn't even feel a thumb, it was just weight, so yeah. I thought it was bottom. I had this here. And then it. I struck it, it was like. Gone. So I think that uh, we don't have the top five at the moment. No. <laughs> I think maybe Headbanger is uh, having the top five at the moment. They have really good waters and a really skilled angler, so it's a good combo. <laughs> Yes. About the biggest fish, maybe we got it. A 12.6 kilo fish is, is a good fish. Yeah, it's a good but, fish, uh, but you never know. Yeah, but but <laughs> there can come up yeah. whatever. Yeah. And uh, my our, our hope that we got one point yesterday. yesterday. Yeah. Uh, I really hope that. Yeah. I don't think so, but I hope. Yeah. If we are lucky. Could be enough. It could be enough, yeah, but, uh, but uh, probably not. <laughs> probably not. <laughs> no, we can only guess that Stroft is going for big fish as well. Yeah, and they know the waters and everything, so everything can happen with them. Also, CVC, like last episode, they always do something yeah. crazy. Vision also. Yeah, Diva so, could be <laughs> Diva really. with Keskitolo yeah, and uh, they are also like it's. It's crazy how you need to perform. Yeah. Uh, I think this fly versus jerk, my feeling, because I've seen the weather at home, I think uh, this fly versus jerk, there are many big fish that comes up. So we really need to do our best until the end. We need one more fish and then uh, you will uh, have to do the magic the, the <laughs> last 10 minutes. <laughs> One meter fish now, so we can, so we just have that 77 to... <laughs> to kick out. Yeah, I will do my best. Sjukt en molotta, så tror jag du behöver fan med över fem kilo. Fan! Kick, 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 kick. Fan, inte för! Here, 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 here. Yep, 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 yep. Good fish, good fish upgrade. Woohoo, we saw what I did. You, you, you I lost it. I twisted. Did you, twitched did, it. Did you hear me again? 
<laughs> That's how you go from zero to hero in like two seconds. <laughs> okay, it's not a meter fish, but it's a beautiful pike. Beautiful, beautiful. Are you sure about that? Ah, uh, maybe we, maybe, maybe we don't, we don't know. I'm not so sure about that. That's a chunky pike right there. Team Gigarotnu are 7 cm behind Headbanger on the top 5 board and their smallest one is 92 cm. So if this one is 99 cm or bigger, they will snatch the point. Beautiful pike. Would have been longer if we had a fin. Someone <laughs> ate it? Yeah. That ate a couple of, sec couple of centimeters. I have 97. 97? Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Healthy pike. So we're on our way. We still need that monster. Come on guys, cheer for us. We need that monster. Come on. Great upgrade for Jigarot New taking them to a top five of 516 centimeters. That's a very strong score, but still two centimeters behind Marcus and Manuel. Their smallest one is 80 centimeters. So if they catch one more big fish, they could secure a crazy top five. Fish. Oh, finally. Took a while. What do you think? Talk yeah, it? it should be a meter fish. Okay. If you just lift it up now. I can't see anything. Okay. Let's go. Other side. <laughs> oh, might be a good fish. Okay, here it comes. Yeah. Oh, it's just burning. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Oh man. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. That felt good. Oh, so nice. So nice. Oh, that's a meter fish. That's what we needed. Yeah. Now we are done. Have a seat. Uh, shall we go home now? <laughs> <laughs> oh. I actually got a little bit nervous there. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, what a day. Good job, man. Thanks. Nice, finally. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, man. 107? Oh, yeah. 107, man. 107 fish. I'm so glad for this fish. <laughs> That's <laughs> we'll 27 we... centimeters for us. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so nice. Okay, I really need to like continue fishing now. If something is happening, we oh, yeah. can take that really huge fish. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what missing. we need now. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Woo! Very impressive fishing by Team Headbanger once again. For the second day in a row, they now have five fish over one meter on the board and they're close to beating their own record from yesterday. Team Catch with Care, on the other hand, are struggling hard and even though they see the fish, they just won't commit to strike. Yeah, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah, I see. But it's not coming fast enough. Yeah, but it's coming. Yeah, no. Ooh. What? He's not coming on mine, is he? We missed it. Come again. No. Mm. Oh. He's there. Oi, oi, oi. That's a big one. That's a really big pipe. But hey, he like swim before no, it. Oh, he missed it. He Fucking idiot. Oh. <laughs> it's not even to find the pipe. They also gonna. <laughs> <laughs> oy, 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 oy. Asshole! We have seen so many big fish. Lots of bait fish in the area. Lots of big mammoths swimming around here. But they don't take. We have tried the Mega Live. We have some followers. But they don't take. It's totally off. They have some food. Of course. Oof! So much bait fish is crazy! Right guys, one hour left of the competition and we are still hunting for the big one. Uh, and by big one, we mean big one. Because that is probably our only chance to snatch the points we need to win. So we have one hour, focus, cast and hook a monster. That's the plan. Come on man. Let's do it, brother. Yep. Yes, give it to me. Yep. Probably right. 75. Yeah, good, good, Anders. Yay. Yay. Number three. 
Ah, it's about 75, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. 70, yeah. Ah, no. yeah. 76. No. It's touching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 76. Okay, good. Good. That could be important. Imagine if we get to 110 fish and we have about five meters. What time is it? We have an hour to go. Yep. One hour to go. So we are back to our hotspot, which hasn't been really producing fish so far, but we still have high hopes for this place. So rest of the time, we're gonna just be grinding for one big fish. Oh, no, it's nice. It's nice light now. Oh, fish. Fish. Sorry. Oh uh, yes. Oh, it's fish. Uh, it's not much bigger than my fly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> As I said, we're grinding for one big fish. Yeah. And you got it. Yeah. <laughs> Good job, man. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if these guys are in this area, <laughs> it's gonna be harder. The big ones are. Oh, but still, nice and healthy bike. Perfect bait size. Yeah. Oh, last chance. Last chance. Less than one hour left of the tournament, and Team Neistroft are making one final move to get onto some active fish. They hold the biggest fish of the tournament, so if they can get into a draw situation, they are likely to be the winners. So, 45 minutes left. We went back to the place where we caught the 115, 10.4 kilogram yesterday. There's last chance to catch a big one. I have to say I'm really exhausted. Even if it was a really great tournament, I'm also a bit happy that in 45 minutes I can go home and go sleep in my bed. <laughs> but hey, 45 minutes, enough time to catch a big pike. And that's sure. what we do now. Let's do it. Ah, mate, do it. I love you for this big fish you caught, but catch another big fish, please. I love you for the 115, so get another one, all right? All right. <laughs> Yo, dibby dibby dibby. Yo, fish, fish, big one. Oh, another big fish. I thought it was big. Small? Felt big at first. No, it's a small Smaller giant. But hey, it's fish. I'm just But hey, they're active. Ah, they're active. They're active. Let's do it. It's a really, really good strike. That was a bite. I got my heart pumping. It's good. It's good. Bop. Let's see if his mother is home. Free snacks! Come get them here! I think they're all gonna swim in now. <laughs> okay, so we've found an area here, like crazy amount of bait fish. There's bait fish everywhere. Uh, problem is, there's so much bait fish and probably we would be able to catch some good sized pike in it, but we don't have the time. We have 30 minutes to go. Uh, so Truman will be in the back, casting, 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 and I will be moving out of the bait fish, trying to find one individual going high up in the surface, like for catching on the live sonar. So, wish us luck. We need it. We have 26 min minutes left, and uh, Victor has promised a Hollywood ending for uh, <laughs> <laughs> for this day. So now we are going to move, so Victor can show all his moves. Hollywood movies end with someone dies as well, so <laughs> you never know. There is one pike after you now. I have one following. Yeah, yeah. I will try the black one, the small and the 35 instead. I don't know where she went. There. Yeah, there. They are like, I'm gonna... They are so lame, like. 
After trying the two smaller sizes of the catfish with no reaction, Victor decides to give the 45cm version a swim. Sometimes when there's a lot of large sized bait fish in the area, it takes some proper meat to get the big girls going and they desperately need one more fish for their top 5, but time is quickly running out. Yeah, it's coming. The big one is coming now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a long one. Yes. Nice. Yes. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, they're fucking monster cat. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, long and skinny. That's all right now. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, oh, what a take! It's not a heavy fish, but it's long. Oh, now you were worth that. I'm telling you, the last uh, last time you will do the magic. Oh Jesus! That <laughs> take, man. That I'm take. So boom! <laughs> it was absolutely insane. <laughs> oh Jesus! Okay, uh, that's a that's yeah. a 115. Yeah, I think so. Damn, the monster cat. <laughs> like the again. average on that uh, lure has been good. Yeah. Okay. Length. Yeah. We don't need any weight Where on this. Where is the board? It's right there. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see it. Wait, I just. Yeah. Don't throw it. Oh uh. uh, yeah, she's long. Uh. Yeah, she's really long. Yeah. She's uh, really long. Away. Yeah. She is one. Yeah, one. Do you have it there? Yeah. Yeah. Twenty. Yeah. One twenty. <laughs> one twenty. Oh, nice. Hollywood ending. They promised. Hollywood ending. They delivered. With less than 30 minutes left of the tournament, Team Leech Gator finally caught their fifth pike of the day, resulting in a top five of 526 centimeters. Still not in the same league as Headbanger, but damn what a nice last minute beauty, Alex and Victor. Okay, she's going back now, our fifth fish, 120, skinny but long, a real competition fish. Ah, Jesus Alex, that lure and that take was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's fun. That's so nice. Finally. 120. <laughs> Finally. We filled, the, we filled the paper. <laughs> Victor Söderberg. Ah, oh, Jesus. So fucking nice. Now everything is possible. Now everything, everything is possible. Let's go. Let's go. Now we don't need to fish any other color. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> now we got like live proof. I, well, how many? I threw three lures, yeah. but not the monster cat. And then she just came up and uh, that strike. <laughs> <laughs> it was amazing. <laughs> Looks like a giant sperm. <laughs> yeah, but they like it. <laughs> they like it. <laughs> okay, let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Three days of hardcore pike fishing in the hunt for the biggest and most pike is very soon coming to an end. The teams have made tens of thousands of casts and caught some absolute monsters. And now, there's only time for one more cast. Okay then, and we have uh, one minute left. This is my last cast of Fly vs Jerk 14. And then this is it my had, last it cast. It has been a nice ride with a... You great. have been outstanding Christian. Great first day. You have day. been amazing. Thanks Anders. Thanks for great work. Great job my friend. And great thank job, you for the friend. birthday presents. And yeah and happy birthday. Thank you for all of us, all of you that have followed Team Diva. We did our best. And we see you at the Sport Fishing Fair. See you at Sport Fishing Fair. We come, will be there. Come meet us there. Yeah. Take care. Great. Oh my god. 
Come oh. here, come here, mate. It was a pleasure fishing with you. Yes, it was. Oh. Hey, even if we don't have a chance to win, your fish was fucking amazing. True. 15.80 kilogram, 128 centimeter. Personal, Personal best. best. Can't be better. <laughs> oh. Hey, guys, thanks for watching. Um, unfortunately, today we didn't make a good show, but we will be back, hopefully. Yes. Thanks for all your comments. Thanks for all the support. Thumbs up. See, See you next time. time. Bye. Ladies and gentlemen, Fly vs. Jörg 14 is officially over and we do have a result. The final day was tough as f for most of the teams, but some of them managed to crack the code and bagged some insane results. Team Powerboat Mercury secured a number point by a landslide with 72 pike, but their tactic of going for the big fish point in the afternoon didn't hold up all the way. Three of the teams ended up with a top 5 of over 5 meters, which is crazy, but the point was once again secured by Team Headbanger with a freaking 545 centimeters. Last but not least, the big fish point goes to Team Leech Gator with a 12.6 kilo beast and they would most likely have gotten the point with their last minute 120 as well. This gives us a tie between Team Leech Gator and Team Headbanger who both have two points each, but there can only be one winner, so the one of those two teams with the biggest pie caught in the tournament gets one extra draw point. Ladies and gentlemen, give a huge round of applause for Alexander Alexeyev and Viktor Söderberg in Team Leech Gator, the official winners of Fly vs. Year 14! We run the town, run the street and two. Let's go, keep free, come through All of the man, they're ready for war You can never test my crew They can't beat my team Rise to the top, we live in the dream We can't believe we're so focused Size my victory, don't approach us We run the town, run the street, them too Let's go, keep free, come through All of the man, they're ready for war We can never test my crew They can't beat my team Rise to the top, we live in the dream We can't believe we're so focused Size my victory, don't approach us I'm the champion, I'm living glorious I'm the champion, I'll be victorious. I'm the champion, I'll live in glorious. I'm the champion, I'll be victorious. We hope you enjoyed this season of Fly vs. Jerk. We'll be back in one year with another round, so feel free to subscribe to the channel. We can't wait to see you all at the Fly vs. Jerk Open qualification in June, and if you haven't registered your team yet, now is the time to do so. My name is Mille Pettersson, and you have been watching Fly vs. Jerk 14.